let's continue so i'm posting on social media for god not for my parents i'm obedient to god with his help when you pretend you did not see my video i'm still gonna post on social media in obedience to god i am pleasing god not you i'm doing it for god not for my parents god is my rewarder not my parents Whenever they tell someone happy birthday, the person will say, how did you know? My parents will say, I saw it on the media. They don't want to say Facebook name. So I don't know they are on Facebook. Who are you deceiving? You are deceiving yourself. Another manipulation. Hmm. My parents, they have their own bathroom. Oh. They will come into my bathroom, mess up the zinc, pour water all over the zinc. I got so irritated, I was angry, God calmed me down, and God said just ignore them. So I cleaned it and I ignored them. They are trying to provoke me. Another one, my dad told me he had an issue with his iPhone. So he told me to help him as soon as I clicked on Safari. Hmm, guess what I saw? I saw my book. Hmm. My dad was pretending that he did not know I wrote a book. My sa his safari showed that he, he was watching me on social media. He even clicked my book. Hmm. He was so ashamed of himself. He must have been thinking, hey, I should have deleted my safari before I gave Taye my phone. Oh. Sometimes you think no one sees you. Hmm. People are watching your videos, reading your books. Hey. Even if they are pretending they are not, ignore them. Focus on God. Before going on social media, God told me a lot of people will not support this call for my life, even my family, but ignore them. My testimony is not for them. My testimony is for certain people who are going through what I went through. My dad needs to get on his knees and cry to God to help him to stop manipulating me. When God helps him, he needs to write a book saying how God helped me to be a better father. Yes, turn your pain into purpose. If you have a manipulative father like me, hmm, run to God to help you. I see God as my father God is filling the void of my father. Don't go having sugar daddies. Don't go having spouse to fill the void of your father. Go to God to fill that void. God is my daddy. Hey, I have a father. His name is God, Jesus, Holy Spirit, three in one. I wake up saying, Good morning, daddy. God is my daddy. Same for you too. See God as your daddy. No matter how wicked your biological father is, see God as your heavenly father. As your daddy. I am that I am. Hmm. That is what God told me to be doing. Anytime I remember my father's bad ways, hmm, and I wonder, hey, B. <laughs> oh, but I don't like staying outside though. Hey, God, save me. Oh, this thing me. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> so I wonder how this this can <laughs> I wonder how can this be my father? He's so wicked and manipulative. God said ignore him. He will undo him. God said I should not like I should look at him as my father. So God is my father. If you have no father, God is my and God is your father. <laughs> so if your father is wicked, God is your father. Amen. Praise God. <laughs>